It is the dominant variant of COVID-19 throughout the state. But with the new version, does care change? Team 12's Michael Downer is verifying that for us tonight. Yeah, guys, the CDC says the Omicron variant right now is responsible for the vast majority of cases in the United States. And early indications are that this variant is much more contagious, but also may be less likely to put you in the hospital. So is treatment of the Omicron variant different from the Delta or previous variants? Our sources are the CDC and Valley physician, Dr. Andrew Carroll. The treatment at home is pretty much the same. We want you to rest. We want you to drink a lot of fluids. Try to stay away from healthy people and uh, Tylenol if you're feeling achy and tired. So Dr. Andrew Carroll says for the vast majority of cases, care will remain the same. But where things have changed are potentially for the more serious cases. Specifically, which monoclonal therapies doctors can use. It's an antibody. It's a specific antibody against COVID. And what happens is that we put it into your system, they attach to COVID, your body recognizes it as a foreign invader, and then sends all the killer cells to it to try to eliminate it for you. See, doctors used to have several options of these therapies to choose from, but because of Omicron's numerous mutations on the spike protein, only one of those therapies is still effective. So we can verify that unless you have a more serious case, the care for Omicron remains the same as past variants of COVID. Stay home, rest, drink fluids, and take Tylenol to help with the pain. So from day one, and now we're day number 730, just keep, let's keep going. Have something you want us to verify? Call, email, or text us.